My traditions are very weak to be here to talk about CSR and sports. Because the CSR part, I'm quite ignorant about the CSR part. I only remember CSR engineer. <laughs> but sports is dear to all of us and to me. In fact, Sai Baba, I was able to indict because I persuaded the government to give 2% as sportsman's quota in those days. And he was one of those, but he left us for syndicate back. And uh, playing cricket with people like him, Srinivasan, and uh, or non-playing captains like Gopal Krishna. It was a great pleasure. I'm glad I was asked to speak here. Uh, whatever I understood about uh, CSR, Corporate social responsibility. You know, the corporates have two types of stakeholders. The main stakeholder is the shareholder. But they are also, got, most of them have customers. If uh, they are in durable goods manufacture, customers include all those who be victims of their goods. If they are producing energy, whether idle, solar or other devices. They have to worry about the customers. Sometimes they don't worry because of the PPP model. They can hike the electricity charges, include FSA and so on. So they, are, they have to balance these interests. Mainly for them, the shareholders' interests are very important. And we can't blame them. So keeping that in mind, if they engage in CSR, they would obviously look for opportunities which will enhance their image, which will <coughs> increase the possibility of sale of their products and so on. That is why we find great deal of enthusiasm in corporates to participate in IPL and other matches because they get a lot of publicity out of that. But it's not easy for the Sports Coaching Foundation or similar bodies, non-profit, to enthuse them, very difficult because their priorities, as I learned recently, is in health, education and some rural development work. So to bring in sports, the people in charge of sports, like including the foundation, they will have to convince them that we are reaching out to people who will in future be your customers, your shareholders, and so on and so forth, and that we are also doing something like the Sports Coaching Foundation, Sai Baba, I was seeing the video when I came, he's encouraging a lot of uh, children from the, if I am correct, so from, many. from slums and other area to come and play, to pick up good health, to pick up good manners, and incidentally become good sportsmen. Not everybody can become a Gulam Ahmad or uh, Azharuddin or BBS Lakshman or Abbas Ali Beg or even Sai Baba. But they can at least be something like me and BK Sinwas. They can come up to that level because it changes the mental makeup. It helps them to uh, build up proper relations. I am talking of cricket, but there are other team sports which I believe you are also encouraging like tennis and also you are Basket. karate lessons yes. I find. Yes. So all these make them move with each other. So your social responsibility which you are discharging is in bringing society together. You must convince the corporates that this is the kind of, if they have a social responsibility, you also are uh, having a social responsibility. So you must be encouraged in some way. Even if the priority, like I said, 2%, even if the priority out of the CSR funds, I don't know, I'm told the Companies Act is saying, earmark some, some percentage, I don't know the percentage. In that, at least 5% should come to sports. And we should all help people like Mr. Sai Baba and the whole group of uh, those who are helping him in the Sports Coaching Foundation to carry this forward. I know how much he is struggling against odds. We should not be, uh, you know, taken 
by surprise or be impressed by having it in Taj Krishna. That is because he has a relationship with the corporate he was managing to see it. But he must be able to build up such relationships, translate into not simply funding, but involvement of both the corporate as well as the foundation. With these few words, I would like to congratulate Sayanama for having organized this and brought such a illustrious gathering around to talk about this. I am afraid I am not staying throughout those who are going to speak out to me. Will forgive me if I leave. I am not enjoying good health for the last few months. I have to go early. But I am very happy to be, have been here. I wish uh, Sports Coaching Foundation all success. Having played there, having battered for your fast bowling machine, I know how good the whole setup is. Thank you.